It was warm yesterday, it's warm today. I wear this on my walk to work. So because it was warm when I got home, I threw open my windows. Then I was hanging out in my room and a while later I could smell a skunk and I was like, I didn't know there were skunks, it's not skunk. so it should be fine. They sent me the questionnaire by post so I can fill it out in advance. It's shorter than the Canadian one and the Brits don't seem to care if I've been in contact with monkeys or monkey fluids. But I did have to call, I hate calling, the helpline so they could check the countries I've been to in the last six months. I assumed Canada would just be totally fine but they're screening us for West Nile. Cause I remember the last time I heard of a Canadian with West Nile. That could just be ignorance. They estimate the appointment. I'm allowed to go, I do not have West Nile. We'll take an hour. Which is the Canadian estimate as well but in Canada you fill out the much longer questionnaire once you're there, so something unexpected is taking up time. I'm pretty curious about what? Maybe everyone here bleeds as slowly as I do. One time I bled for 15 minutes and I couldn't even fill the bag! They had enough to use and the nurse was just like, you're done. Okay, can I have a cookie? They know what they're doing. I hope the Brits give me cookies. How bummed am I gonna be if they're only serving tea? Thanks for watching! Subscribe for new videos every Tuesday and Friday. Bye! AFC will do the playoffs! <laughs>